Hey guys, it is Monday morning. Taking out some trash. And uh, yeah, I'm also gonna take out that hiker backpack that I found a couple of days ago. You know, it seemed like a nice bag at the time. However, once I brought it inside, I could smell it and it smells kind of like cheese. Part of me wanted to keep it anyways and like cut it up and then I'd make my own like storage part of the bag. Like, I like the frame of it, but, hey, you know, it's already a complete thing. Like, someone else would probably find it and like it. And the other thing is, like, the, like, liner of it is, like, all peeling and stuff. And, I don't know, kind of nasty. It's, like, nasty, smells cheesy, and just, someone else can deal with this. I don't know. But anyways, gonna go out and do some Uber Eats. A bit after 10 right now and yeah I got a double order in Chinatown and Yin Jin Cheng Feng and yeah a lot of soup so hopefully this does not spill first drop off 14 York Street the classic Airbnb ghost hotel thing and then 10 York as well both places you can't go into the building you just have to meet people in the lobby and uh yeah then I picked up from some cafe and rode across over to 85 Queens Wharf yeah decent view up here I think it was the 8th floor kind of forget I can see my bicycle always nice to see my bike and I got some Kibo Sushi from across the Sky Dome. It's kind of neat, passing by the CN Tower. I always think it's kind of neat, you know? I'm just like living in a tourist town, seeing the sights. I guess, I don't know, how, how much of a tourist town do you think Toronto is? I mean, in Ontario, it's pretty much the most touristy town, right? Yeah. So yeah, oh yeah, the people gotta speed up just to pass me, like, these a-holes. But yeah, I'm in Brookfield Place now, we've set up some Christmas lights, kinda neat in their food court they have a TV set up for the World Cup, and the place that I was looking for was right by the entrance, but I was hidden behind a pillar, so annoying but I found it. And I also picked up from Egg Smart two loose coffees in my bag. Will it spill? Along Gerard, the road is pretty smooth but then on the resident road I was like oh god I almost hit a pothole in here. Could have ruined everything. And uh turns out everything's okay. No spillage. Except for when I'm taking it out I almost spilled it there but now nah, we're all good. And uh, in front of that apartment building, someone's throwing out some like riced cauliflower. I don't know if that would have tasted good, but it's like a box of it. I thought about it, but yeah, I'm in the middle of doing Uber still. Uh, and then this place was like, search for this name, and it's just G, but there's so many names in here. I'm wondering if they just never clear out the uh, directory or if there's really like a thousand people that live in this building. I'm using my gamer button mash skills to get through it. And after all that, they didn't even answer. <laughs> I had to call them and tell them to come to the lobby. And uh, yeah, also picked up from this butter chicken place. They used to be across the street and now they have this bigger space. So I'm like, wow, good for you butter chicken guys. Yeah, passing by Allen Gardens. Still lots of tents set up. I wonder what they're gonna do in the winter. If they're just gonna make it through the winter in the tent. Who knows? I hope they make it alright. I saw some studies and stuff about how there's like 10,000 uh, homeless people in Toronto. And about 130 people get turned away from shelters every day. 
just because there's not enough beds in space for them. And the shelters seem like a pretty shit place to be, you know, safety wise and stuff. And uh, yeah, did my last delivery over at this uh, CBC or CIBC building. I wanted to go to the elevated park, but again, there's no good spots to lock my bike, so kind of went across the street and then I had to like loop around at the crossing to get back to the stairs here. And uh, yeah, a lot of stairs. Kind of wondering if anyone's even going to be up here. There was news stories about uh, people coming and checking it out when it first opened and then getting kicked out by security since they're like, there's no pictures allowed up here and stuff. It's like, what? It was a privately owned public space, so they could do that, I guess. But when I was up here, there's only one other person and they were taking pictures as well, so. I just took a bunch of videos. And yeah, pretty neat. Nice view out to the east here, where you can see the tracks and stuff. I guess half the park is still under construction, or maybe it's gonna like bridge over to something cool. I got a weird metal tree there. Kinda neat, I guess. Then looking out to the west, it's not as nice of a view. I mean, you can see the CN Tower, but it's mostly the Union Station rooftop, so it's kind of boring. So yeah, all in all, just a small space, but uh, kind of neat. Got a few gardens up here, lots of birch trees planted. Kind of a curious choice since uh, the bark is pretty fragile in birch trees, I bet they're going to get fucked up by somebody. And yeah, I can see my bike down there. Yeah. So, I don't know, kind of a neat spot. And then, uh, yeah, my phone is under 20% battery, so not going to do any more Uber. I guess it's like cold today or something, because it died in like two hours. Or I only did Uber for two hours before it got too low for me to do more. And, uh, yeah. Checking out the Loblaws, see if they had any good deals. I got some pecans, or uh, pecan butter tarts, for like 370 or something. That was okay, but didn't have anything else that was good. And yeah, just heading back home now. Before I charged up my stuff, I wanted to see if my uh, backpack that I threw out was still there. And it's gone already. So, that's nice. Hopefully somebody likes that. Now uh, 42.40 for my 2 hours and 15 minutes online. Not the best, but I don't know, it's Monday. And uh, yeah, wanted to go to Freshco today, stock up on like snacks and stuff. For tomorrow I'm doing my uh, Ubisoft playtest for a mystery game. I don't know what it is yet. I got these Cheerios since they were on sale some pumpkin Cheerios. Still thinking about those giant bugs of popcorn. I could be, I could be a popcorn man. Yeah, I also bought some meatballs even though these used to be seven dollars and now they're ten dollars. But the no frills ones, they don't even, it seems like they don't have them in no frills anymore. So that kind of sucks. Oh well. Yeah. Went home and ate food, had a nap. It was a really big nap. The kind of nap where I was like, what day is it when I woke up? And also Rainbow came by and had a nap as well. Yeah, good hanging out. After that, I just played video games for the rest of the day. Thought about going out again, but eh, maybe later. <laughs> 